Blackberry love, no thank you. Don't know what producer you buying from. I'm shopping with meals, baby. Yo, what is your YouTube? This is the King, and I'm back with another video. Today, I'm going to teach you guys how to get all five of your Playmaker and your Point Four badges. Hall of Fame. If you haven't noticed, share the Playmaker and the Point Four. It's pretty much the same position. You got the same badges, and the grind is the same. And today, I'm going to teach you guys how to get all five of those badges. Hall of Fame. The easiest, the fastest way possible, in my opinion. If you have different ways of getting these badges, please leave it in the comment section below. Maybe you can help somebody else get their badges a different type of way. Alright, now let's get down to the grinding. I'm going to show you guys how to get three badges right here. Really, four badges. But we're going to start out with just three right now. I'm going to show you guys how to get three badges at the exact same time. That's Pick and Roll Maestro, Dimer, and angle breaker. Alright. Now once you have the ball in your hand, you want to perform a double move which will activate your angle breaker. Call for a screen, let the screen go, hold Y. Once you make it close to the basket, let Y go, he go up. I know that's very fast and probably hard to understand, but it's simple. Once you have the ball in your hand, perform a double move. Once your double move is being performed, hold LB to call for that pick and roll from your power forward or your center. Now with the pick and roll maestro, you don't have to use the pick and roll at all. As long as that icon pops up above the center or the power forward head, once the icon pops up, you can let LB go and keep calling it back and forth if you want to. If you want to get that badge or you want to get that uh, achievement going towards that badge more than once in one session, you can. But don't forget to perform a double move leading to scoring. Call for that screen. Call for that screen. When you see the icon, hold Y to get someone diving to the basket. Once they get close enough to the basket, let Y go. Your man will throw the ball to him and he should go up and finish every time. Because you're playing on rookie. Do not forget to put the game on rookie. Alright? Now that's the, that's three badges right there you can get. Okay, now that I showed you how to get those three badges. Right there in that section, I'm gonna throw in um, Lob City Passer within the mix. You can do this. You actually, you really can do all four of these badges at the same time if you want to. But sometimes the roll man doesn't act right. But I'm gonna show you how to get Pick and Roll Maestro in with your badges. So you can grind all four. You can grind four badges at the same time because the last badge is Flashy Passer. I legit y'all got Flashy Passer in two games, and it probably took me six quarters, twelve minute quarters. Easy. The badge is simple, easy. That badge, you shouldn't, you shouldn't even need a tutorial on that badge, but I will explain that towards the end of the video. But I'm trying to, I'm gonna show you right here how to get your pick and roll, how to get your, um, your lob city passer within these four badges together. Now check this out. I'm gonna um, hit my double move, call for my pick and roll, use the pick and roll. When he cut, double tap Y, go up. That. That right there, I activated. My double move gave me double move leading to scoring, which go towards Dimer. We know my double move leading to scoring goes towards my anger breaker. I used the pick and roll, pick and roll maestro. I threw the oop, which gave me alley oop passer. And because I threw the oop, that went towards my Dimer. So, pick and roll maestro, Dimer. Angle breaker, Lob City passer. You can legit do all four of those at the same time. But now, give it some time and be patient. If the Lob City passing, if throwing oops not working for you, take a break off it for a little bit. When you get on defense, spam the X button because you should be playing on rookie again. Make sure your game is on rookie. Spam the X button, get the steal. Go straight to the corner, wait for you to see somebody coming down the middle, double tap Y or triangle, throw the oop, and that's how, that's how I really got most of my oops within, like, got my oops fast. If I couldn't get the steal and I had to get back on offense to slow us down, I'd do the first method with the three badges, but if I could get the steal, I'd get the steal and I'd throw the oop. But now I'm going to teach you guys how to get flashy passer. Like I said, it took me six quarters, 12 minute quarters to get it unlocked and Hall of Fame. 
This is the easiest match on the game. This is what you do. It's easy. Got the ball in hand. Double tap B. Call for back. Double tap B. Call for back. Double tap B. Call for back. Double tap B. That's simple. Just keep doing this. Give me the ball. Come on. Give me the ball over here. Give me the ball over here. Just do it. Keep doing this. Two seconds left. You can crash. Crash try to get the rebound. If you don't get the rebound, get back on defense. You can get back on defense. Again, try to get the steal. Run the fast break. Throw the oop. Just like this. This kind of a fast break, but I ain't going to throw the oop. I'm going to go back to working on flashy pass. Throw it. Flashy pass. Call for it back. Flashy pass. Call for it back. I pretty much would do this with the whole 24. This, You will get this badge unlocked within, I'm telling you, you probably can get it done within a probably five quarters because you have to have the badge um at least gold to get a hall of fame but y'all this is it uh, this is the end of this tutorial this is a easy easy um player to grind i will have numbers on how to get every badge how what, when would it be unlocked on bronze um and hall of fame i'll have all that in the description below so make sure you go check that out just in case you got questions on that just in case you just in case you scheming through the video, you're not really watching the video and you miss numbers, I will have numbers in the description below. Anyways, thank y'all for showing love on my glass cleaner video and my shot crit video. I really do appreciate that. I really, really do. I will be dropping a sharp shooting video soon. That will be my last tutorial video as of right now. That tutorial will be the easiest tutorial. I will be able to get that done, that player done probably within a week. Plus me working. So be on the lookout for my sharpshooter video. I will show you guys how to get those badges, badges easy, fast, as quick as possible. Because nobody really want to play my career. You want to get all your Hall of Fame badges, be as best as you can be. Go to the Parker program, show off your skills with your friends, or show them off for of YouTube or Twitch or whatever you do. But anyways, man, I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. If it did, make sure you leave a like. If you got any suggestions or any ways to get the badges easier. Leave it down in the comment comment section below. If you got any questions on how to get the badges, leave that in the comment section below. I'm on Xbox One, Gamer Tag is I King Trey. If you got any other questions that I can't get back to you on YouTube for some reason, hit me up on Xbox. I do live stream daily. The King Trey underscore on Twitch. So make sure you go check me out. But thank you guys for love again. I appreciate that. Until next time, man, I'm signing out of here.